Hi, this is Instructional Development at UC Santa Barbara. This video is five tips to writing course learning outcomes. Tip number one, it's all about the student. In their most basic form, learning outcomes describe the type of thinking that students will do, not what the teacher will do. Start your learning objectives with the phrase, the students will, to help you get into the right frame of mind. Tip number two, use thinking verbs. Figure out what kind of thinking you want the students to do for each topic. Be specific and use action verbs. For example, students will explain, hypothesize, describe, compare, or predict. Never use words like know, learn, or understand because your students could interpret them to mean anything from memorizing vocabulary to defending an argument. Tip number three, use Bloom's taxonomy as a cheat sheet of thinking verbs. It'll save you a ton of time. Tip number four, refer to specific content in your learning outcome. For example, the students will explain the major tenets of Marxist philosophy, or the students will describe the processes of cellular respiration. You want to be descriptive and concise so that your students know exactly what to focus on. Tip number five, align your learning outcomes with course assessments. Determine the ways that students can demonstrate their thinking on an assignment. For example, will your students explain the major tenets of Marxist philosophy in a paper, a presentation, or in an exam question? All three will work if you want students to explain something. You just have to decide which works best for your course and your grading sanity. I hope that these five tips will help you write good learning outcomes. Thanks for watching.